Hey everyone, I'm Jaleesa. Welcome to the Creator Roundup. As always, if you want any more info about what we covered today, check out the description. Let's get started. We've got more exciting studio updates for creators. Both Face Blur and Custom Blur are now a lot easier to find and use. These tools help you blur out your face on any part of your video that you want hidden. You can find these tools by going to Editor, then Blur Parts of Your Video. From there, you can choose Face Blur to protect the privacy of someone in your video, or Custom Blur to create custom shapes over whatever part of the video you want. We've added new shapes, sizing, and positioning options to give you these tools. So check them out. As part of our commitment to improving our captioning and subtitle tools, we're introducing a new captions editor in YouTube Studio. This tool makes it easier and faster to edit automatic captions on your videos or to upload and edit custom captions from scratch. You can more easily access the editor now with its own pop-up window within Studio. Captions are also faster because now they'll sync with your video in real time. We've also made it so that you can now see your caption timing alongside the audio stream for the best possible caption placement. We've linked the forum post about the update in the description below where you can learn more about what the new captions editor has to offer. Okay, so when it comes to automatic captions, we know it's important to be extra careful when it comes to accuracy and what viewers see. That's why we've added a new setting you can select where we won't show potentially inappropriate words. You or your viewers may have noticed this change. Now, potentially inappropriate words in automatic captions are replaced with dashes in between brackets. If you don't want this setting turned on for the automatic captions on your videos, you can opt out and turn it off with the instructions we've linked below. You can also edit them out manually in your captions for individual videos. This month, we announced updates to our age restriction efforts as part of our ongoing work to provide age-appropriate experiences for everyone on YouTube. You can hear more details about this update from our creator liaison, Matt, in the video he made about the announcement linked below. Be sure to check out the pinned comment on the video that answers the top questions we saw about this update. We've also shared a help center article in the description to give more info on what type of content might receive an age restriction. That's it for the Roundup from Home. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye. Transports across the Chanel might have, I said Chanel and that's probably channel. <laughs>